Yeah. We want to make it locally relevant by making sure that the applications that are being developed or pushed out there are creating that relevance. Are you a fisherman? What do you need ICTs for in your life? Bookkeeping, marketing. So we are looking at people who have the local flavor, have the ideas, and have the talent to help them go and extend those services to them. We have a number of programs. Uh, firstly, of course, through the licensing process, we have required all operators to cover 90% of the country in coverage, but we know that is not 100%. So through the fund, we are coming in with other interventions to then cover and address those gaps. We're also coming up with interventions in respect of access to devices. So this process did not look at university people. It was open to say whoever has a good idea out there that can leverage, facilitate the leveraging of ICTs in rural areas should come forward, apply and be considered for this program. So the Makere University Business School was responsible for the selection and then training people because many of us creators, I love to say I'm also a creator, we know how to create but we don't know how to run businesses. So you need to take them through how to run the business, how to appreciate the target, how to make it relevant so that the programs are sustainable. We need to go down to the primary school and we need all hands on deck because as Uganda Communications Commission, we can't do it alone and we can't do everything. So you and I, we can make that happen. We are happy, we are happy back in the city with you people, the city dwellers, until we got a report from the city of that 84% of the, of the fishing community and even the, the border borders, the women are yearning for financial inclusion. So we, we, we left the city, leave the city, to go and empower financially the person at the grassroots. We want to impact lives of the visually impaired students and business people. First of all, to create independence. The visually impaired can read from home and businessmen uh, reduced from the risk of fake money.